Hey guys, so lucky me, I just picked up a new 20 inch Pro Blackstone and I'm seasoning it for the first time. I've got one coat of oil on it so far and just applied the second. Um, just wanted to give you an update with this of how you really apply it. So you can see right now it's smoking pretty good. Um, that's because I just put the second on there. So once it stops smoking, I'm going to do a third coat and I'll go over with you what I'm doing on the third coat. Got it running on high like you're supposed to, so all three currently are on high. If we look at the temperature, um, we're currently operating about 450, a little over that, around the edges. Towards the middle is a little over 500. Um, so it's definitely hot enough to do what it should be doing. So it tells me my regulator is running correctly. And I'll be back in a minute when I apply my second coat. All right, so it's still smoking a little bit, so not ready to put the next coat on. But I did want to show you something. This is a great opportunity to see it. So. This has been running on high for at least a half an hour, um, but you can see the outside edges, how they still aren't um, changing colors yet. That's a great indication of how the heat zones work on your griddle. So if you're ever questioning like, my food's cooking too fast and I've got it down on low, where do I, what do I need to do? You can move your food to the edges and it's not gonna cook quite so quick. So um, this is a great indicator of just how quick the middle of it seasons, but the outsides don't. I also wanted to point out that um, in the instructions it says to use uh, paper towels you can do that um, but I find that you go through paper towels fairly quickly you can also use 100% cotton so I'm just using 100% cotton dish towel um, I'm just using uh, pure canola oil and um, that's gotten the best seasoning for me on my first Blackstone so doing it again here in the second um, we're just about done here smoking on this one so I'm gonna go ahead and apply my third coat to it um, it only takes about a tablespoon or so, so we're just going to put a little bit on there and you can see how quick it's going to run because it's so hot. So all you got to do is gather that in your rag and then we're going to go around all the edges first. And then once we got that, then I do the sides. And so the sides is just going to be right up along the edge there. And I'm getting the inside right now. And we'll get this side over here. And one other thing about having a dish towel is that you don't really have to use tongs. So you can get your fingers in there to really feel what you're doing. As long as you have it over wrapped a couple times to make sure the heat doesn't transfer through right away. If you can feel oil on your fingers, you're going to feel the heat because it's going to transfer right through that oil super quick and burn your fingers. So just make sure that you feel dryness and you should be fine. So I've got the edges all taken care of. And I go ahead and do the outsides too, then you don't have to, because I just like that black grill look to it. So that's pretty much it. And so now we'll wait for this to stop smoking again. You can see it's smoking good. It takes about 10, 15 minutes. Once that happens, I'll come back and do a fourth coat, fifth coat, and sixth coat. I uh, won't torture you with all that. Just wanted to give you a heads up. All right, guys, we'll see you later.